hello friends this is the third video tutorial into the series of web scrapping with what we are learning with the help of python and beautiful soap module of that uh, python so in this tutorial we'll see about how to select uh, individual html element based on the class and based on the attribute so let us see what do you mean by the class and what does the uh, by attribute based on uh, by class and attribute how we can uh, find individual element of uh, HTML with the help of this beautiful soap module okay uh, let us consider this uh, URL first actually so this is a different URL compared to what we used in the earlier uh, uh, video so it has a lot of text some text are red and uh, some text are uh, green let us see its source code so if you click right click and view page source then you will get to know about that uh, there are a lot of spam span element paragraph elements are there and if you just search for class there are a lot of class are associated with each element some are red and some are green so suppose you want to extract all element which is having just the class uh, red only or you want to extract uh, all element which is having class green then you can do with the help of uh, this beautiful soap library so I have my development environment uh, ready here so uh, let's begin with this uh, first import uh, uh, URL lib library okay there is one more correction in uh, last lecture we found some uh, error that error is uh, finds due to there are two aspects are associated with this url lib uh, so suppose if you are using python uh, 2x version means uh, any series of two version then in that case you need to use this url lib 2 library but i was using url lib that's why it was giving uh, some error regarding to that exception uh, handling case and if you are using uh, python uh, 3.0 or 3.2 3.1 3x series version you they have renamed url lib 2 library to the url lib so you in that case you need to use url lib so here i am using python 2.7 version so that is a 2x series version of the python so i am using uh, url lib 2 library so this is how i have imported uh, url lib 2 library now let us import the beautiful uh, soap library so mm, bs4 will import beautiful soap function from it okay that's all so uh, let's first fetch this uh, URL this is what we did uh, already earlier like in lecture with the help of URL open function okay we got all HTML stream let us just cross verify whether we have actually got it or not okay correct so this is what exactly whole HTML contain what we see here that's what we have got it okay now uh, the task is to find how we will uh, find to find all element having class red okay let's see how we can do it with the help of a uh, beautiful uh, soap function so let's supply this HTML plus the to the uh, beautiful soap function and we'll use lxml parser okay there is a typo here okay so we have got the bs function it's that is where actually uh, whatever the simple html uh, string we have 
a uh, beautiful soap function has converted into object level hierarchy that where the individual content lies now we want to find all elements which is having a class uh, red so what we'll do um, will bs dot it has one method like a find all so it will find all element and we'll supply argument like a span so it will find all element which is having a tag name span but we want to find all element which is having a class red so in this way you can supply all element having a class red with a tag name span and we will put it into class tag list will will put it into red tag list red tag list okay okay so it works successfully now let us print all element because there are number of red elements we have to iterate it so for tag in red tag list and let us print all individual element mm, there is some problem associated with this let me print this red tag list first oh it's a blank actually let's find the green one first okay so we have got all the green element which is green element which is uh, class having a green tag okay okay now let's print those green so instead of just red we'll put it as a green and we'll display the text okay okay so it's working fine that is all because of some session issue and all those there so if you write the uh, full code inside the single cell uh, there won't be any uh, mischievous problem so if you consider this anna uh, let us cross verify with the help of our source code okay so you have seen this anna having a class green okay so it's working perfectly fine actually so we have extracted with the help of this function all element having a class green and a tag name span now let us consider the second one which is uh, how to select uh, individual el element with the help of uh, attribute now attribute uh, means uh, we'll see about the id okay now just consider this id id is having tag so suppose you want to extract all element which is having a id is equal to text now let us see how we can do it actually uh, we'll use the same bs object uh, in return we'll put it into text text object okay find all now we'll supply id is equal to text so it will tell us that give me all element which is having id is equal to text okay and let's print this text object now the uh, rather than iterating let's just uh, print the first element so it will just give us first element get text 
okay done so see this is the well prince uh, so genio so this is what it has given us inside this div element having a id tags it has printed all the content of this uh, element which is having id is equal to uh, tags okay uh, that's it for now uh, so we have seen about how to select different element based on the class and uh, attribute in a future video we'll see about how to select the parent of individual element and a sibling of individual element how to select the multiple children of individual uh, element uh, that's it for uh, this lecture uh, i hope you enjoyed this video uh, thank you guys for the watching please do like comment and subscribe it